In the previous video, we enabled auditing for our organization. In this video, we'll start auditing the user access and see it in action. So to audit user access, what we need to do is click on global audit settings and select audit user access. So once we do that, we'll start auditing who is accessing the system at what time. So just click on OK. Now let's see it in action. I have now logged out of my CRM organization and I'm going to log back in. So we'll now see what happens when we look at the audit logs. I'm going to the audit section, audit settings, click on the down arrow next to settings, auditing. So to see the uh, audit of the user access, just click on audit summary view. So there you go, you will see that at this particular time, the user Nikhil has logged in. Okay, the event is user has accessed the CRM organization via web. Okay, and the time he uh, he logged in was at 5:12 p.m. And the user is Nikhil Rajin. So yeah, this is how you uh, enable auditing for user access and look at the logs of the user access. Another important point to note about audit summary view is that it is a location where you will find all the audit logs of your organization. It includes the audit logs of the user access. It also includes the audit logs of the updates which has been performed on records, etc. In the next video, we will look at how to enable auditing at the entity and the field levels and see it in action.